YouTube and welcome to lesson 32 of the Autodesk Maya 2017 training series. So on the last lesson, we actually saw how to batch render. And in this lesson, we are going to continue with render sequence, which is a new feature inside of Maya. So the process is actually same. So I have my animation ready right here. It's the same animation as before. So I'm going to go over onto my render sequence right here. And I'm going to make sure that of course, like image format is APZ, it's name number extension, frame padding is four, start frame is one, end frame is 200, camera one, 640 by 480. So all the settings remain the same. And now I'm going to go into rendering and instead of render uh, batch render, I'm gonna go into render sequence. So if I were to check all of these and then I don't have to really check on these. So I'm gonna check all these and do render sequence and close. So what it does, instead of just rendering into uh, the in uh, the background this actually shows up in the render view as you can see right here so it is actually rendering out as you can see now I can actually see which frame is being rendered at the time so that I can actually see the animation moving frame to frame and is being rendered at the same time so I'm gonna uh, skip this video to the part where it renders to 200 frames now and now my render sequence is done and you can see that I actually have a preview of this now over here on the render view itself and I have all the frames. So all the frames are actually saved up uh, in the images folder itself inside the temporary folder now, right? And you can see that I actually rendered this out but I forgot to select the camera that I'm rendering so it actually rendered out the same frame but uh, it does the same thing anyways. So. Anyways, hope you guys learned something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.